Leukemia and Lymphoma Society, or LLS, want you to meet some kids that have a lot in common with you. They like and do the same things you do. When I went to school, I thought my friends would kind of look at me different and um, kind of think I was different, but I'm still the same person. When I went back to school, I didn't want people looking at me all the time, at my bald head, and I didn't want to be labeled as the cancer kid. I was afraid that my friends would think they could catch my cancer, but you can't catch cancer because it's not contagious. I told my friends I can't give you cancer. It doesn't work like that. These kids are just like you, except they have a blood cancer. Cancer is not like the flu. It's not contagious. My sister was afraid that she could catch my cancer. She asked my mom about it, and my mom told her that you can't catch cancer. Dying is a possibility for everyone, but I feel pretty good. Cancer is a very dangerous disease, and it can cause death. But kids can fight it and win. The main way kids fight cancer is by going through treatments. And there are four treatments that kids might go through. Chemotherapy, radiation, bone marrow transplant, and surgery. Chemotherapy is a treatment kids do to battle their cancer. And they receive chemotherapy either orally or through IV. Some kids receive IV chemotherapy. They receive liquid medicine through a port or a Hickman. A port or a Hickman is a type of central line that is placed during surgery. I receive my chemotherapy through a port line. They put you to sleep in surgery and they put a little plastic doorbell type thing and every time you go in you get poked and they can put all your medicine through it. My memories of the hospital are mostly the nurses and doctors wanting to help you and being tired. When you're at the hospital, you don't get any sleep. Pretty much you have fluids going through your body 24-7. Your friend or classmate may be using radiation as one way to treat their cancer. With this method, a radiotherapy machine uses powerful x-rays or high-energy electrons to shrink or destroy the cancerous tumor. Finally, your friend or classmate may be getting a bone marrow transplant. In this treatment, the doctors put healthy blood stem cells in place of the unhealthy ones, and this can treat or even cure the disease. With help from students like yourself, you can help LLS continue the research that saved the lives of kids just like you.